So here we are in a local bus and people have bought it and they are about to go and sell their goods to the market. So it's something that's quite important here because it wasn't always the case to have a bus that would go around because for a bus to go around you need a road. Let's find out how all of this is happening. If there's one problem confronting the development of these communities here is having road facilities. And so the UNAP is implementing a feeder roads rehabilitation project in the community of Iliasa. And the process of doing this is by employing labor-based intensive work, which also includes women who are an integral part of this project. <laughs> I love watching these women work in their dresses. It's so impressive and it's important to note that the road building projects by UNOPS are the first ones in the Gambia ever to involve women so it's a pretty big step forward to inclusiveness and that is very inspiring because the future of any place is about having a strong community, a strong bond that can last for a long time. From Iliasa we are here in Al Kalikunda and right in this place we have a road that has already been inaugurated by the president a few weeks ago and this is also part of UNOP's rehabilitation project. So let's go check out how this road feels and meet the women down there who are currently maintaining it. The road does not feel bumpy at all compared to all the roads we've been on. We're actually standing up right now in the back of the car. It's so cute, I'm loving it. <laughs> I was able to get a lot of money. I was able to get a lot of money. I was able